Hello and welcome to Finland. ABB continues to invest in marine and ports research and development with the opening of a new lab here in Finland. I've been speaking to one of its pioneers, Miko Lepisto, about what the future holds for this new venture. This is the first time you know, we are able to test and develop all the marine integrated systems in the, in the same stage, in the same room, at the same time outside the ship. And if you, if you think of it, we wanted to have a sandbox uh, to develop new things, to test new things and take our customers here to, to, to help us to develop solutions faster. The term uh, Internet of Things is very important to ABB. Um, how does that play out in this lab? Well, Internet of Things is something that is here today. So we already have a lot of offerings, data-driven uh, services to our customers where we uh, collect information from the sensors and we route them through our systems to the clouds so that our service people can deliver uh, new services. It also helps us to develop new products and systems because we are able to distinguish what, the, what uh, sensor data and what kind of data is important for, for, for our future. Uh, solutions. Yeah, from an from engineer's point of view, uh, behind us we see this, this very nice new lab. Uh, the other side of the cameras are lots of computers, lots of wires, lots of computer stations. Like, how, how do those two, two ends meet up? As I said, this is the first time now that we are able to test everything from the sensor to the screen. So basically we can very fast uh, change the configuration that we are testing you know, inside this, this, inside this lab and uh, basically route them into, into our uh, visible screens that we see in the camera. Mm. And uh, this has not been possible in the, in the past. Normally you see these solutions meeting at the ship. So now we can really make sure that everything is working before we take the solutions to the ships. Yeah, can you give us some insight into the, the exciting things that are being developed here at the moment and are likely to be developed in the near future? Well, of course what you see here, uh, they are solutions that we have today. But because we have this room, we can invite our customers here to, to, to do joint creation so that they can actually see what exists and that we can much faster draw out uh, new solutions and uh, test them here in the, in, in the screens together with our customers. So that we, we see that actually the timeline from an existing solution to the, to the new solution is much shorter uh, with the help of our, our lab. What is the reaction from the shipping industry likely to be? Because I always hear that the shipping industry is conservative, but do you think that's changed in terms of technology? I think it has changed a lot. You know, there's a lot of new technology that we actually see now being implemented on the ships. Like I mentioned, the Internet of Things. We are, we are seeing a lot of things already uh, uh, coming out from, from that kind of offering. Uh, we have solutions that are directly targeted to that. Uh, we have integrated solutions like we see here now uh, that are very much state-of-the-art. And uh, we, are, we are, of course, seeing that, that there's a lot of technology that is coming from the consumer side of the business uh, to the marine business, and the expectations are also growing uh, very fast. 